Hi everyone. I have received some beautiful, beautiful mail and I would like to share it with you. This is from Beegroff and it is First of all, a lovely napkin. And secondly, it's just the loveliest tag. This is... <clears throat> I participated in Bee Grub's um, Face the Scraps tag exchange. And um, we were to use a, make a tag, and we were to use a dress form, which I didn't have one. And so instead, I made a dress for my tag. And then uh, we were to use, make a little uh, spool of thread, and this is hers right here. And we were to emboss, use embossing which I also didn't have. So I just made a background of uh, mixed media style. <clears throat> and this is lace. Oh, it's so beautiful. And um, so I wanted to come on and show you that. She was not my, she was not my two um, exchange partners. She just sent it to me. Um, I guess for to thank me for participating and I'm going to do another tag in that group. It's a lovely group. So there we go. And this is this is such a gorgeous just a happy meal I think. And there are many different things in here. <clears throat> I can get it all out for you to see. You may recognize Nina Rabina's uh, style. It's her style is just the most beautiful. Um, rich colors. She wrote me a note on the back. This is a piece of her art. And <clears throat> colorfulness to brighten your day. <clears throat> well, I'm not feeling very well today. And um, so I did receive this yesterday out of the mailbox. And um, Nina's art is characterized by really rich fullness of color and depth, depth of layers. And you can tell how, you can tell by the art how deep the layers are. Just one on top of another on top of another. And um, I've watched her do her art many times and it's, that that's what she does. She just puts layer upon layer of color. I'm showing you these strips. These are photocopies of her art. And um, this, I, of course I, I couldn't wait to open it. This is enormously colorful and rich again in the art. And she was inspired by a certain artist, um, and I can't remember the artist's name. I'll have to look that up. That also uses this depth of color and just gorgeous embellishments of beads and <coughs> braid and um, lace that is uh, super colorful. Um, she embossed it 
very thick embossing over, I'd say, um, modeling paste. And then this, these beads at the bottom with, with the braid. It's just beautiful, Nina. So beautiful. And then she stacked an embellishment here. I think it's called a stack with different colors and different um, different um, this is just gorgeous different types of trim and it's on just so simple so beautiful um, and yet so rich with depth of color characterizes Nina's art. So, um, <clears throat> Nina, I just love that. That's just, that's just beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful. And, um, and then she, um, gifted me some, some really lovely I believe these are die cuts. I don't have a die cut machine, but I sure do love die cuts. And they're just perfectly cut out uh, embellishments for, for, <clears throat> for my art. Look at how delicate this, this butterfly is. I hope that you can see that. It's really delicate. And this one, too. Just beautiful. All of these are embellishments for um, die cuts, which I know everybody knows. I'm just, I'm just thrilled with them. Tiny hearts eggs, lovely eggs. That just inspires a nest of some kind or uh, something like that. Beautiful. Thank you so much, Nina. Thank you so much for these things. I don't have these things. Um, my little limited budget has not allowed me to buy these things yet, so but I'm going to, in time, I'm going to buy these beautiful things to work with in my art. Today is my birthday, so perfect day. Also, um, Nina makes washi tape, and this is some of her beautiful art you can see in her washi tape. And I'll just uh, glue that back together. I tried to get it off without tearing it, um, but I'll just glue that back together so that I can use it again. And then this is some of this is so neat. This is shaving cream art. I've seen this done before. Um, I watched her do it on her channel too, and I just think it makes beautiful designs and images. And this is a, uh, a beautiful, um, this is a telephone book. I just love telephone books. I don't know why. I just, it's not a telephone book exactly. It, it's a, Nina, it looks like a, I don't know what it is. It, it has, it looks like it has uh, people's names, their country, and maybe the latitude and longitude of them. I don't know. This is so interesting just to look at. Someone, some listing is for Australia, Penang, Australia, England, Scotland, USSR. These these are um, somehow 
locations. And then I, I love this. She sent me napkins. Napkins! And it looks like they're painted, but they're not. They're, you know, it's printed, but um, you, you could, this could inspire a painting easily. I just love it. And look at the owls. Aren't they cute? I love them. You just can't. You have to open it. I love it. Isn't that beautiful? The colors. I hoard these a little bit right now because they're so beautiful and you know, I don't have a lot of stuff like that. I just bought some napkins for Happy Mail. Here's some some more of the shaving cream. Look at the colors. Rich. Rich with colors. She's got some uh, metallic blue in there. Oh, such pretty color. More napkins with the birds. Such, such pretty things, Nina. Such pretty things. I love maps. And um, she put some paint on here. This would make a great piece of collage for a painting. I love it. And here's another one of her cards. And she has signed it. Notice she has edged it. That means it's finished. And look at that richness and depth. Would you just look at that? I mean, it's hard to see the bottom layer. There are so many layers on here. I really love that. This is, um, this is her alcohol art. This is cardstock, I'd say. And I just think that's so beautiful. I watched her do that on her videos. And this is on photo paper, on the back of photo paper. Look at how beautiful that is. Thank you, Nina. Oh, thank you so much. And one more beautiful napkin for with butterflies. <clears throat> Nina, you didn't know that you were sending me a birthday gift, but you are. So there's my timer. And um, I would like to have a birthday giveaway. I'm sending out Happy Mail. I keep saying that, but I, it's true. I have it all ready to go now. And... Um, <clears throat> but I'm going to have a birthday giveaway. Today is my birthday, so uh, everyone who mentions, uh, leaves a comment um, in this video, I would like to, um, I would like you to know that this is uh, the only way that you have to Sign up for my birthday giveaway, and it's going to be running all during the all during the uh, rest of the month. <clears throat> I'm just going to put something on here so that everything will focus, and <clears throat> and then. At the end of the month, I'll have a drawing for the giveaway. I don't know what exactly I'm going to give away. I have to put together some things for that. Um, <clears throat> and
and just let me know in the comments. Uh, you need to be a subscriber of my channel and um, leave a comment in uh, the comment section of this video. So thank you. Thank you for subscribing. Thank you for commenting. Bye-bye.